So, Cooljaman day three. Got it been up at 4.30 this morning to leave really, really early because we've got a big day all the way over to Wolf Creek, about a thousand Ks. Got her unpacked, got her in the car, and the car won't start. Flat battery. So luckily two people woke up at the campsite. Uh, one of them's in a rooftop tent, has no jump starter. The other one doesn't know what a jump starter is. So we're waiting for someone else to wake up, or uh, the staff. Uh, the staff don't actually start until eight o'clock here, so we could be waiting a while. And we're cooking with gas. So the first time, off to Broome to buy one. <laughs> Because I'm not having that happen again. Need a figure I hold away to love like we did before. made Wolf Creek Campground, um, yeah, because we left Kuljaman late because of the flat battery this morning, um, we had a bit of, uh, yeah, we ran two hours late getting here, coming out the road out of Kuljaman was really deep sand, but we made it through into Broome and then along the Savannah Way, the road through the Savannah Way was incredible, all of a sudden probably about 100 k's outside of Broome, we hit the Boab trees, they just appeared out of nowhere okay. and turned onto the Tanama Road just as sunset was coming in, so I had to do the 150 k's pretty much sunset into the dark. It was a very long day, I think we actually ended up getting away at 7 and we got here at 8. So it was pretty much a solid 13 hours, I think the longest we stopped for was about 10 minutes, so yeah, it was a long... Mm, thousand k's, 1100 k's, something like that today. Yeah, it was a long, long day, but we're gonna get up dawn tomorrow and go check it out. For that white night to shower you in bright lights, provide you happy and but that's not me. I, moonlight under dark skies, still find comfort at night. I could fall for you and leave before. The so, this is the Tanami Road that was listed as four wheel drive only at the moment. As you can see, it is in pretty good condition, it's a little bit rough in spots, but that's about as bad as it gets. Just had the engine overheat warning light come on. But in Japanese, it says pull over, low raise bonnet, cool down. I mean, it's 40 something degrees, so it's not really cooling down that much. Looking at the radiator, it is rather full of bugs. Um, small birds, butterflies, I don't even know, everything in there. So, hopefully, letting it cool down runs okay. We're off the dirt roads now, it seems to start overheating on the dirt roads a bit more. Started driving in and it just started cooking again. So let's pull the whole front of the car off, clean the radiator out. Hopefully this works. Um, we finally found the leak in the radiator. 
There's a heater in the rear of the old grand. Um, and so there's two pipes that run from the radiator all the way to right near the tailpipe. And last night on the Tanami Road and right near Wolf Creek, we absolutely tagged the tailpipe, bottomed it out. Phil and I were devastated that um, they only had, they didn't have any family rooms. They only had a two better and a three better. So we had to put grandma in a room with the kids and we got a room to ourselves. Very sad about that. Very devastated, but, you know, we got a lovely room. No kids. Well, what takes people up to a year? Don't know how. WA. Eleven days we knocked over WA. Northern Territory. Wake up from your fantasies. This isn't real. If I was you, I'd run. Why do you stay here? There's nothing but pain here, just leave, it's not meant to be You can't change me, I tried, believe me, and I know It's best if you just run, run before you fall in deep I am not the man you seek, you should have known It's not too late to burn This isn't real If I was you, I'd burn